So today is the grand reopening of the St. Luke's Thrift Shop. It's actually 10 o'clock Saturday morning and we're opening for regular hours today and then continuing on with regular hours thereafter next week and hopefully with God's grace continuing forever. So we welcome all of you back and we also welcome those who are working here. I've been told by some of the workers that they don't want to be filmed, so I won't do that. Um, but we're going to go inside, and for any of you who haven't been to our thrift shop, it's a lovely place to be in the shop, in a very hospitable place. We have some rules that have been implemented during this time of transition to opening in view of our in pandemic. Mask must be worn inside while you're here. Please honor our social distancing requirements and our limitation of the number of people that can be here at any given time and we welcome you all back um, during this time we have a spot it, to the if, as you're facing the thrift shop to the right of the thrift shop where donations can be left we have erected a tent so that anything that you drop off will be protected from the weather and it will be left for three or four days to air out so that our handlers and workers will not be in any harm's way as a result of whatever touching has gone on with the items um, in the past so we're entering the front door and I'm showing you our hours these are the hours of our thrift shop and as soon as I walk in, I'm going to be greeted by some wonderful people. <laughs> no, you don't. Our Dorothea and our Pat. And I tell you, you guys are on video right now. And um, there's Pat I'll be good. prepared to receive all of your money, but also prepared to receive and give all of your love because oh. we're reopening. Unbelievable, yes. And, and Dorothy is hiding over in the corner. That's right. Now, Dorothy can turn and face me so I can see her face. Uh -huh. Or she can turn the other way and I'll see the back side. But, That's the so she's, side. <laughs> she's, chosen, she's chosen the face. So here's Dorothy and Pat who are constant presences oh. in our parish. And I like your mask. Where'd you get that Somers mask? It was donated to me by a wonderful woman named Adelaide who has made it her ministry during this time to construct masks at home and sell them and she's donated all of her proceeds to our food pantry. Fantastic. And she made this one special Especially for me. So I wear super. it. So here's what we got in the thrift shop folks. So you need to come and see it. There's one of a kind gifts here that you can buy for incredibly low prices. Just as an example, $2 for these beautiful earrings. They would normally sell probably for 10 times that much at least. Um, one of the things about our thrift shop is that it is in and of itself its own community because there are people who shop here who frequent this place and who come for not only the things they can buy but also for giving of their own presence to all the people who work here and all the folks who bring donations to our shop. So, this is an uncensored view of our thrift shop. Um, 
Yeah, certainly is Ollie. <laughs> um, and then this is the middle room. This is formerly the residence residence of one of our prior rectors here, and it's been converted, as you can see, to a store on the lower level. And on the upper level, we have people who reside here. But this is not just a place to come and shop. It is a place to be. It is a place to engage in community. And in addition to all of the lovely things that you can buy here, you can come and just hang out and visit and be in community and even look at yourself in the mirror if you want to. But there's a lot of love and a lot of tenderness and a lot of care that go into this place. And a number of people in our parish who give totally without any return to them monetarily but only giving with the return of your love and your spirit and if you have occasion just to drop by and maybe even plop down a dollar or two for something that is worth eminently more than that then we would welcome you and we would welcome your presence and your conversation with us. <laughs>